and to press on the insecurity the country is in and that the nation look forward to them for rapid relief. During our four hour security meeting, I have taken the responsibility as commander in chief for you to go out into the field and secure the country. I have accepted responsibility for your actions in the field. It's up to you to identify your competent officers, irrespective of seniority and FIFA qualification, and deploy them to make sure that we secure this country. We have got a few weeks to do that because by the rainy season we expect people to develop confidence and go back to the land so that we don't get in trouble by being away from the field and therefore unable to produce enough food for the nation. We all look forward to you to perform, and I, as the CNC, I am begging you a hundred percent, and I expect you to effectively deploy your officers and men to secure the country. I thank you very much, and I wish all of us the best of luck. Thank you very much. Mr. President, I'm highly delighted and honored this morning to be before you, having been decorated with my new rank of general, and to say that on behalf of the service chiefs, we are grateful to the Almighty God for the health, and to you, Mr. President, for the honor and trust that you have bestowed on us. Let me, on behalf of the service chiefs, inform Mr. President that the mandate which you've given us is very clear, and which is to do everything possible to address all the security challenges facing us as a nation. We know that the inevitable, and which of course I'd like to use this opportunity to present to Nigerians, that the inevitable is that Nigeria we have peace again. Mr. President, on behalf of the service chiefs, I'd like to pledge the unalloyed loyalty of the members of the armed forces of Nigeria to you, Mr. President, and to the constitution of the Federal Republic of Nigeria. We will, based on the mandate and the trust that you have bestowed on us, do everything in our power to address all issues appertaining to insecurity in the country, working in concert with other security agencies and, of course, the ministries, department and agencies in that regard. Let me once again thank you, Mr. President, for this honor, and thank you, Nigerians. God bless you, sir. Thank you.